Scott. Come on at you. I, that did not come out as a word. That was Papa Squat, what I always say at the beginning of my videos, but <coughs> caught in my throat. A um, few things. This will, this video, uh, so after this, I only have 12 videos to go before I hit 2,000 uploads here on the channel. If you have some suggestions as to what I should listen to for, or what I should do for number 2,000, let me know. Uh, just put it in the comments. I check out the comments. Um, I respond to comments every now and again. I take some th ideas and thoughts from there and just try to keep up with what's going on. Um, but yes, let me know what you think I should do for the 2,000th video, just because... You know, it's an anniversary sort of thing. Um, we're going to listen to Sewer Person. Uh, this is called This is a Lullaby. And uh, I... Hello. How are you? So you coming down? But there's no place for you to go. Yeah, I have stuff in my lap. I'm sorry. This is Vasya. She would like to lay in my lap now, but uh, there's not really room. She's going to complain about it. Um... So, uh, what was I saying? Uh, 2000th video, um, that's, that's all I remember. Uh, I'm distracted. Numos is, uh, gonna be hosting a night with Baby Tron, July 6th. If you are in the area and want to check him out, come on down, 27 to $30, and you can see him. Um, what else was I gonna say? Uh, I found a mixtape from 1984. A friend of mine made for me. And uh, this com contains some funky music from when I was 13 or 14 years old. No, 14 or 15 years old. Uh, probably got it that summer from my friend Paul. And um, it has some crazy stuff on it. And uh, I shared this to Instagram and Facebook. And a buddy of mine uh, put together a playlist for it. So I'm going to share that playlist with all of you. I hope my friend doesn't mind because I didn't ask him if I could share it. Um, it's a bunch of music. It's got everything from AEIOU Sometimes Why to Run DMC's Rock Box and 8 Million Stories from Curtis Blow, Stop, Stepping Out from Steel Pulse, uh, LaGrange from ZZ Top, New Year's Day from U2, uh, Speak Like a Child from The Style Council, uh, Original Sin from NXS, there's even Huey Lewis on here, Bananarama. Like, there is, this is a crazy mix of music, and this was a, a this was a, cassette that I had with me in my Walkman. I would go mow my grandma's lawn, mow my home's lawn, and I would listen to this. And uh, Howard Jones and a bunch of other stuff. Oh yeah, I listen to it a lot. Listen to it a lot. And this is where some of my love of hip hop, rap, reggae, alternative, new wave music came from. Good music just in general, in my opinion, of course. Uh, but I'll link this down below if you want to check it out and want to listen to <laughs> what I was listening to 40 years ago, uh, which is insane to think of. Like, I, it's 2023, right? And I'm talking about music from 1984, so I guess 39 years ago, right? And it is the weirdest thing in the world to me to think that if in 1984 I was talking about this, like, World War II would have just ended 40 years ago. And uh, that's a really weird thing to think, because it doesn't feel like it's been that long. Because 1944 seems like forever ago to me. But that's because it was 30-something years before I was born. No, 20-something years before I was born. And so that's like ancient history, right? So anyway, it's such a weird thing to think about. It makes me feel like I'm old, but I know I'm not, so <laughs> I'm not even going to think about that. Um, let's get to this. HC sent in some Sewer Person. This is a lullaby. This was uh, by Sewer Person and Jabari on the Beat. I've really liked everything from Jabari on the Beat. So let's check this out. Oh, God, I feel like I'm forgetting something else. I don't remember. If you want to... Um, Join my Patreon, you can do that. The information is in here. I'm very distracted. It's late. I'm tired. I'm losing my train of thought. Um, everything is normal. Uh, oh, that was the other thing I was going to say, is I'm going to put together a playlist uh, tomorrow, the What I've Been Listening To Lately uh, playlist, and uh, that'll be the one for May. Um, 
and I'll probably have another dozen or so songs on that list. So come on back, check that out. I'll post that in um, in the playlists, but I'll also post it probably as a story and share it. Uh, so check that out. That's in addition to the to the uh, mixtape that I have on Spotify that I'll share down below. Let's do this. This is a lullaby from Sewer Person. Came out in 2020. Produced by Kim Pei. Uh, ooh, Tokyo Wall and Jabari on the beat. This is track number eight on Comet 3. And uh, it's Sewer Person and Jabari on the beat, so I know I'm going to like it. So let's just see what this is like. Two minutes, 45 seconds. Uh, I checked to see if I had reacted to this already because it's getting to that point with uh, Sewer Person that I have to make sure. And um, I didn't see anything with the name Lullaby on the channel, so I think I'm safe. Let's go. Thanks again to HC. I have lyrics over here, but looks. Oh, this is a lyric video. It's easier for me this way. Memories come back to me strong. These boys so I drank, so I'm gone. With my life, you really had to go out. On the sun, while I'm back on them drugs. thoughts on this you probably see me smiling <laughs> uh, it, it, this is a really interesting song um, I have to kind of run through this again to see so he starts out it, oh, this is really it, it's more interesting than I thought it was he starts out and it seems like a very kind of what I would say kind of a typical sewer person song right like oh okay he's Memories come back through to me strong, just pouring something, I drink something, I'm gone. Okay, so he's he's self-medicating again. Um, with my life, you really had to grow up. Oh, I'm sorry, my mind. I'm back on them drugs. So it's like he's he's backsliding, right? He's not he's doing what he shouldn't do. He's self-medicating. He's and then <clears throat> talks about his relationship, baby girl. It's not you. I'm screwed up. The medication won't even let me fuck. We've talked about that. The Cinepril or Zoloft or whatever. Sertraline, that's that's what it is. Sertraline, not not. Listen to Pearl, I'm thinking about something else. Uh, that is a heart medicine that I take. Uh, sertraline uh, really screws up your ability to to have sex. Um, but he, he's talking about that. I broke down. She broke down. Really hope that we work out. Like it's all this stuff that he his his normal kind of ah fuck. I got to deal with this in a relationship again. And this is the stuff that I think a lot of people really identify with because people go through the same sorts of shit, right? And then it gets into the second paragraph, or really the first verse. It's, Life's too hard, baby. Life's not fair. I would never give up on you. I'm too comfortable. I don't understand that line necessarily. I'm just to comfort you. I just want to comfort you. Is that understandable? Uh, who gets along like we do? Rest the bitches all evil. 
Uh, you've been part of my people. I don't ever want no sequel. Baby girl, I'm so evil. Again, he's got to give himself shit. Baby girl, I'm too evil. Corpse blood in the steeple. Yeah, baby girl, I'm, I'm a heathen. So he goes on, and but he's talking about like how much he's nuts for this girl. How much he wants to be there for her. How much he's dedicated to her. And and even if uh, like later on he can't always be there because he's busy with stuff right oh I gotta go when will I see you let me know oh look at my heart yeah she finna melt the snow she give me textbook head yeah she went to Harvard yeah I'm so paralyzed I said I love you a thousand times he's just he's crazy for this girl and and later on talks about how she taught him how to trust again and how to love again and how, you're like it, this is he's he's in the relationship that he wants to be in right and because it's him it sounds like it's a sad song but it's not this is like this is a supportive song this is him trying to reach out to her and say like even though i'm not there like i'm there with you like i'm here to help you i can i'll do whatever i need to i'm writing this song for you to be able to listen to and remember that i'm here and it's and it's kind of funny because he says it's a lullaby but then he doesn't sing it at all like a lullaby which i think might be kind of a jokey thing because uh, it seems so counterintuitive um, that he would say this is a lullaby for you and then it's not a lullaby at, at all so I wonder if they kind of joked about it like oh you should sing it like you normally do like your music <laughs> like it's kind of belted out with this just it's a fantastic voice that he has it's so so good it's really really good I'm, I absolutely love it i love it it's so good this is a lullaby that he yells this this is a lovely lullaby to help you sleep at night baby i hope you're feeling right sorry i got zero time you taught me how to love again how to trust again i know you've been hurting but i'm right here to hold you tight and i break down but the cause isn't important like i i might freak out but it doesn't it doesn't matter i just wish i could make you feel wanted i know it's dark on this path but we got this Listen to my words when you're close to a forfeit, please. Like, if you're going to give up, just listen, like, lean on me. Even if I can't be there, listen to this song. It's so good. It's so good. And it's so... It's 180 degrees from, well, from Ninetales. Um, but it's so... It's like maybe 160 degrees from what Sewer Person normally does, right? Maybe 90 degrees. It's like a complete just turn left right it's so, it's so good it's really fantastic trying to give no one else my heart he's done he doesn't want to have to find anybody else like he is happy with this woman it's so fantastic it's so good it's so good love that song 100 percent love it also going on my favorites also getting loud downloaded love it love it love it love it if you want a love song from sewer person this is your love song And it talks about all the right stuff, like, <laughs> I'm messed up in the head, I'm self-medicating, I break down, and then he just says, like, this is just, this is just what it is, and like, we, somehow we get along, and somehow it's awesome, and I just want to be there for you, and even if I do break down, it doesn't matter, because that's just what I'm going to do, and... I want to be here for you. I told you I love you a thousand times. I'm always going to be here for you. I don't want anybody else. Like, you're it. You are it. You're my person. I absolutely get this. Absolutely. This is fantastic. Love it. I absolutely love it. I mean, big surprise. I'm talking about it like a crazy person, too. So, awesome stuff. Thank you for sending this in, Pop Squad. Check it out. Please like, subscribe, and share. Um, this is amazing. This is just amazing. Have a good night. Uh, remember, if you want to send me 
money and songs to react to information is down below if you want to join my patreon it's down below the mixtape is down below um be on the lookout for the um what i'm listening to playlist that i'll post tomorrow uh tomorrow being the 31st of may and um yeah ah oh, good music tonight really good that's why i do this shit is just to have a little break from the day and find awesome music that Brockhampton song was amazing this was amazing it's great to hear also Bob the Builder from J Mommy Jr. somebody new always love hearing new stuff ah such a good night thank you very much everybody um, 12 more videos and we'll be at 2,000 videos on the channel let me know what you want have a good night bye bye